Hello. With the rise of severe allergic reactions occurring, we are making a video to educate the public and North Board School staff what to do if an anaphylaxis attack occurs. This is a situation that could happen. Hello everyone. Uh, how are you today? Good. Okay. Um, I corrected your test and it's not looking really good. Uh, we might have to redo redo them. So um, I'll start handing them out. No. Hey dude, you want this? I really like it. Yeah. Now as you may have guessed, this is an extremely bad idea. Because Cedric has a very highly allergic reaction to peanuts. And in this sandwich is peanut butter. I don't know if you can go, man. Well, what's that? It was just a peanut butter salad <laughs> sandwich. Whoa! Whoa! Hey, 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 stay with us. Hey, breathe, breathe. What's going on? What's going on? He's having an allergic reaction to peanut. He's no bad guy. Thank you. Hey, here's Jeffrey Ben. Stop him. Yeah! You're gonna be alright, Teddy. You're gonna be alright. Remember, anaphylaxis is a life threatening emergency, and a fast response is crucial. Check for a healthcare plan that all teachers should have on hand. Call 911, administer EpiPen by removing cap, injecting into thigh, and listening for click. Hold for 10 seconds. Do not leave patient unattended. Wait for ambulance to arrive. Now that you've seen the video, you know how serious anaphylaxis can be. First, I want to show a little more clearly how you inject the EpiPen. When you pull the EpiPen out, you want to look through the window and see if it's clear. If it's cloudy, you don't want to use it. You pull off the blue tab, you grab it like with your thumb not on the end, take a swinging motion into the thigh, and there you're going to hold for 10 seconds and remove it and that'll give you the dose of epinephrine. Epinephrine is a form of adrenaline, <clears throat> which we all know we have when we have fear or fight or flight. They come out with a new EpiPen that's now automated and explains everything to you. This is the new AviQ EpiPen. So you open this up this and it's gonna talk to you. This contains no needle or drug. If you are ready to use, Pull off red safety guard. To inject, place black end against outer thigh. Then press firmly and hold in place for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Injection complete. Now, this one... trainer may be reused for treatment.
one thing you have to know, whenever you use epinephrine, you need to get the EMS on the way. Why is that? First of all, the epinephrine is going to take at least 10 minutes, maybe 5 to 10 minutes before it's going to start working. So your patient may go in to severe anaphylaxis, in which case they may pass out. You want maybe to have to use a second dose of epinephrine, which sometimes you don't have. So you're going to depend on your EMS people to have that for you. So if the epinephrine is injected and the patient is not responding, he may collapse from anaphylactic shock. What are you going to do? Well, first of all, you're going to have to open the airway and you may have to do rescue breathing. So let's take a look. Our patient now has had his epinephrine, but it's, the anaphylaxis has continued until now he's unconscious. This is pretty serious. And what happens is the airway most likely has swollen somewhat so he can't breathe and his blood pressure has dropped. So you might have to do CPR. So you're going to first of all open the airway, open the airway, then to do, you're going to check for a pulse. If he has a pulse, it's chances are he's just not breathing. So you're going to do rescue breathing. You want to close the nose, open the mouth, open the jaw, and now you're going to do your rescue breathing. The breaths, and you're going to give a breath every five seconds. If he doesn't have a pulse, of course, you're going to start CPR, and you're going to be pressing at 100 a minute. This is going to be, you're going to be wanting EMS to be on their way whenever you use the EpiPen. So that's the training that you're going to need to have. The EpiPen's available in the locker, and don't hesitate to use it. The side effects of using epinephrine, just think of adrenaline, fight or flight. Your heart rate's going to race. You may get anxious. You may get a little shaky. You might get, it opens up your lungs. You're going to breathe a little more deeply. Uh, and you may get a splitting headache. And those are the things you can look for after you give that epinephrine. Alrighty. So, um, hope the best for you. And actually, hope you never have to use it. Good deal. And action. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> what to do if an anaphylaxis sh attack occurs? <laughs> and action. Hello. With the rise of anaphylaxis, a it was just a peanut butter jelly sandwich. We're gonna have a real life-threatening emergency soon. <laughs> you can't do it with Miss Wilson.